My name is Garrett Porter. I'm a main tank. My name is Alan Arce. I play support. My name is Lindsay Caudill. I am an Overwatch analyst. My name is Eric Auberg. I'm the student director. My name is Kylo Morkenthal. My position is DPS. My name is Kyung Ju. I play top lane. Hi, my name is Carlin. I play jungle for UT Dallas. As a support player, I pretty much have to make sure I'm keeping the rest of my team alive and focusing on staying alive because the enemy team always wants to kill me. Sometimes I can do both being like a tank or possibly even playing damage. Our job is mostly to deal as much damage to the enemy team. I'm like the front line, so I stand in front make sure the, the rest of my team is safe and kind of control space. Basically my role is to facilitate my teammates and to help them perform at their best. And what I kind of do is oversee the program, oversee the teams, help with social media, PR, and things like that. We watch individual gameplay as well as team gameplay, differentiate between what can be fixed and what we have also nailed, especially between different metas and compositions and things like that. The one thing that I think people should understand about eSports is generally they kind of view gamers as like kind of unathletic all that stuff but I think it's kind of a blessing. It's basically an equal playing field like you don't have to be born at a certain height to go to play. We practice like any other sport team here at UTD. We practice three times a week about three to four hours each practice. We'll play certain maps and we'll come up with a specific strategy for that map. It changes what characters we play, where we play, and basically everything kind of changes for every single map. So we have to have a, a game plan for every situation. Um, we'll just watch to see how they execute it and what individual mistakes one may make or the team makes as a whole, especially with communication or positioning, and then we kind of go from there to help them kind of fix it. We use Discord, which is a like on online like uh, communication software. We'll uh, communicate over strategies, like before you know certain specific fight starts and like during the fight is going on. I think we have a lot of fun. I mean, of course, sometimes we'll we can get kind of kind of down when we're not doing well, but but we always we always come back, have fun, laugh about it later, and I think we we all want to improve. Uh, taking away lessons from each loss is the most important thing. It's where you learn the most. Taking that loss and using it as like a learning experience and then moving forward from then, building on top of your mistakes so you can become better. Practice, watch people who you think are better than you. That's I think that's one of the things that helped me improve the most is finding someone who I think is better than me and then picking one thing that they do and doing that until I can move on one thing at a time. We're all kind of nerdy, it's kind of a nerdy campus and I think that it's just the perfect place to cultivate the high level players and just a good community as well. We have a bunch of bright, um, very smart, intelligent students that come here. A lot of them obviously do like to spend their times in gaming, but there's a big passion for it. And UTD is like a perfect place to kind of just grab everybody together and mesh that into the ball.